very wet out there, uh, some slippery roads as well. Let's check in now with Crop 4 meteorologist Kyla Groen to get us started. Hi there. So the North Bay is still having a very difficult run. You can see where the area in red is here. That is in a good portion of Sonoma County. And you can also see where we've got some of the rivers that are getting into trouble too. Those are all flood warnings, the area in red. Now, this is basically throughout the day today when we look at Santa Rosa, when we look at Healdsburg, that we're looking out for issues where we've got excessive flooding that's possible. And then if we look at the rivers, that goes through till Monday. And then in general, the entire North Bay for the advisory, that one goes through early Saturday morning. And by early Saturday morning is when we should start to see this atmospheric river kind of cut off a little bit. But right now, you can see it's certainly bringing plenty of showers to the North Bay. In fact, earlier we had precipitation rates of over an inch an hour. Now, as I zoom out here, you can see that it is starting to move much more to the south. And that is because this is a frontal passage, right? So we are going to see things get better for those of you in the North Bay and unfortunately get worse for those of you in places like San Francisco and in the East Bay where you can see now some of those heavier showers are falling and eventually they're going to make their way to the South Bay as well. As we zoom out here, you kind of see that stream of moisture, but instead of being pointed just at the North Bay, now starting to work its way to point south. And these are all storm reports that have gone up in the last 12 hours that are indicating wind, that are indicating some flooding that's happening. Also starting to see snow in the Sierra start falling and that of course is part and parcel of this atmospheric river as well. Here is that main low pressure system right there and there is the frontal passage. Now what's different about a frontal passage is that you get stormy weather ahead of it but you get cool air behind it. So that's going to be something we're going to feel as we get later into the day too. I was looking at 24 hour rain totals and of course these totals are just adding on to each other from days that we've had of rain now but in the last 24 hours we've gotten almost four and a half inches of rain in Santa Rosa. You can see just under two in Napa. Ben Loman in the Santa Cruz Mountains 1.6 six and much less in a spot like Los Gatos. We didn't really have anything measurable in uh, San Jose either. San Francisco, other uh, a tenth of an inch in Oakland, you know, barely registering there with just one hundredth of an inch. So let's go through this afternoon and you can see these heavy showers this is about three o'clock are going to be very present five o'clock rush hour notice the north bay things calming down a bit but we're just getting going in the east and the south bay as we roll through so still a lot to come from this storm we will start to catch a little bit of a break on the weekend at least we'll start to pull back a bit these are the totals i'm expecting for the rest of the day today and notice when you head to point south and you go into the santa cruz mountains places like boulder creek looking to pick up about two and a half inches of rain. All right, Kyla.